It's a very controversial topic whether or not it's safe to take antidepressants during infertility treatment. And we actually published a paper a few months ago, myself along with two infertility doctors and a high-risk OB. And what we showed, we basically surveyed the research, and there are over 100 studies on infertility and pregnancy. Most of the studies are on pregnancy. Two studies looking at infertility patients who were on anti antidepressants, which are called SSRIs. Um, one showed that women were less likely to get pregnant, and one showed they had higher cancellation rates than IVF. But if you look at the pregnancy data, there's a lot more data. Um, women who take antidepressants are more likely to have a miscarriage. They're more likely to have a preterm birth. Um, their baby is more likely to have birth defects. And some of the more recent data is associating antidepressant exposure to some developmental delays in the children, including an increased risk of autism. So if you sort of put that all together, you know, you feel like you're almost putting women in a bind. If they're depressed and they feel like they need to be on medication, what do they do? And again, I think if you go back and look at the data, a lot of the efficacy of antidepressants is actually a placebo effect. That's, that's been shown in a lot of different studies. So what I tell my patients who come in who are taking an SSRI and are worried about staying on it, because now we're, you know, advising people to really think about it, you look at the, all the alternatives, cognitive behavior therapy, mind-body approaches, exercise, I mean, there are lots of other modalities which really are as effective as antidepressant medication in treating depression, especially mild to moderate symptoms. So if you are my patient and you're taking an SSRI, I would suggest you, you start thinking about, you know, trying other approaches first.